NBC Palm Springs Sports Desk, brought to you by Agua Caliente Casinos. We have your game. Hi, I'm Nash Walker. I'm a play-by-play broadcaster for the Palm Springs Power, graduated from the University of Missouri Journalism School. I'm George Hathaway, also a play-by-play broadcaster here for the Palm Springs Power, and I currently attend Dean College. It's been a very exciting season for the Power so far, 10-2. and two. Something that stuck out, I think, for all of us is the quality of pitching, the pitching depth. We saw it again last night, George. Yeah, Brett Finnell, he was on the hill to start things off for the Palm Springs Power. Struck out 11 batters, and it doesn't end there. You have guys like C.J. Broussard and then Evan Shaw as well. Those guys can produce. It's a very deep bullpen for the Palm Springs Power, one of their strengths this season. And the lineup, while they haven't jumped out to early leads, they've battled back, and I think it's a testament Mm -hmm. to the team and their ability to come back in some of these games. We've seen some local kids. You know, Isaiah Alvarez comes in and immediately gets on base at a super high clip. And another guy I really like, Anthony Angel Jr. He's returning to the Palm Springs Power. He's a very familiar face here and another great guy who can get on base, produce runs as well. And this team also likes to steal Nash. They're 10 and two on the season and they're very hot. Casey Dill, their manager, we talked to him before the season. He said there's really not a weakness on this team. And I think that's really stood out through these 12 games. Defensively, they Mm -hmm. picked it up together as well. Very clean, very low errors as well. If one, two might be their most that they produce, but then a lot of times it's zero. And it's very clean baseball, crisp. And that's what you like to see here in Palm Springs. We're going to introduce you to some more standout stars for the power with our friends Evan Schmeiser and Marshall Garvey. Thank you, Nash. Thank you, George. I'm Evan Schmeiser. Just finished school at Sacred Heart School of Sports Broadcasting. And I'm Marshall Garvey, an alumnus of UC Davis. And you know, know, Marshall, I think it's been really impressive so far this season for the power, having all these new guys coming into the lineup, the, the pitching rotation, especially guys who didn't start the season with the power, just coming in for even... Last night, you have Evan Berkey out of Evansville University, Vision 1, three hits in his debut. That is incredible, and it's a real testament to the culture here and the leadership of the Palm Springs Power. You see these new guys come along, like you mentioned, Evan Berkey. Also think of Tori Sweet, Emmanuel Dean, guys that show up, and just as soon as they hit the field, they make a difference and look like they've been here the entire season. Absolutely. Isaiah Alvarez, another one of them, just finished off an appearance in a national championship tournament for Division II Point Loma. It's already made a big impact, especially on the bases. He has, and you mentioned Joey Mazzetti. He leads the team in RBIs, and he's also great on the pitcher's mound. He's had a few relief efforts, and he looks great there as well. Oh, my gosh. Joey Mazzetti does it all. He caught just a couple games ago. He played third base. Didn't even start the first couple games. Now he's emerged as one of the leading sluggers, a leader, and runs batted in for the Palm Springs Power. Can't say enough of the depth. That's something that Casey Dill, the managers, talk so much about, too. Can't say enough about it. Let's not forget how great the starting pitcher is with the likes of Carson Phillips and Brett Finnell. I believe Brett Finnell's got a sizable scoreless inning streak going. Absolutely. He's gone 13 consecutive scoreless innings. Just an amazing team overall. The power, of course, on a, I believe, a seven-game winning streak. They're 10-2 and two on the year. Well, they'll look, to, they'll look to keep that going, obviously. 